The insert distance and bearing dimension command lets you insert a dimension that measures the length and bearing of a line or the distance and bearing between two points. Select the command and the prompt tells you to locate the start of the distance bearing dimension. If you simply select a line using the diamond, the distance and bearing are automatically inserted halfway along the line. However, it's important where you select the line. These two blue lines are both the same length and are parallel. If this left hand one is selected towards the bottom, the distance and bearing are inserted as shown. But if the right hand line is selected near its top, the bearing is different. In fact, it's 180 degrees different. This is because the direction of the line is important for bearing dimensions. The end of the line you are closer to, when you select it, is taken to be the start of the line. Therefore, this line starts here and ends here, giving a bearing of 44 degrees, whereas this line starts here and ends here, giving a bearing in the opposite direction of 224 degrees. If there is no line to select, two points can be selected instead and the distance and bearing between them will be inserted. Click your right mouse button to stop inserting these dimensions. That completes this tutorial.